in achieving the goal of health system development, there is a need for health workforce, which is an essential resource for the movement of the health system. For Thailand, the current political and socio-economic changes have certainly affected the health workforce in terms of inadequacy, urban-rural imbalance distribution, and ineffective support and motivation systems. To effectively resolve the problem of health workforce efficiency, the cooperation of all sectors concerned is required. Volunteer spirit in health services system, a case of Pratnang Klao and Bang Bua Tong hospitals in Nontaburi province. Volunteers have to always realize that the belief in volunteerism and helping other people occurs within themselves. Loving voluntary work, having time for such work, and ready to serve as volunteers. Royal Address of His Majesty King Pumipon Adunyadeh Amid socio-economic changes in Bangkok and its neighboring provinces, including Nontaburi, a small province that was once a renowned agricultural area and learning site on handicraft and culture. This small province by the Chao Priya River is currently being attacked by urbanization with densely populated urban communities, resulting in the changes in people's livelihood. Regarding the health system, the impacts are the rising number of patients at state-run hospitals, the caseload being much greater than the service capacity of existing physicians and other health care providers, and the service recipients' expectations to receive fast services, resulting in litigations and misunderstanding between service providers and recipients. For over 10 years, the Voluntary Assistance Program at Pratnang Klao Hospital has been implemented with the conscience of a group of people who want to help relieve the suffering of and add happiness to the service recipients while being sick. Its aim is also to fulfill the missing part or bridge the gap of understanding between the service recipients and medical personnel under the slogan, Doing Good Deeds Without Conditions helping others wholeheartedly without expecting remuneration. The director of Pratnang Klao Hospital said that the service recipients are more satisfied with the help of the hospital volunteers, who used to be patients and know of the patient's needs. So they are able to fill in the missing part and make the patients feel that the hospital is taking good care of them and really understands their needs. Duong Gao Khan Pai Si, a professional nurse, deems that having volunteers to help facilitate the service process and give some advice to the patients is a good thing, and they are the medium of creating a good understanding between service recipients and providers. It is the power of volunteer spirit that has helped ease the problems of the 456-bed general hospital, relieving the burden of hospital staff in various units as the volunteers take turns in helping existing staff 
in accordance with their knowledge and skills. For example, some of them help at the front office, filling in patients' history records, organizing the folders, taking patients' appointment slips, and recording certain data. Some of them assist at the support units of the hospital. Sitlipan Pomsi, a volunteer assisting at the front office, said that she is proud of being able to assist other people. Some old patients are very pitiful with no relatives accompanying them. I can give advice and help them get through the service steps. The elderly people are another group of volunteers that help with the medicine production process in the hospital, making the staff's operations more flexible and spending their spare time on social services. While Mr. Pairat Tetsawat, a former school teacher who is knowledgeable of Thai traditional medicine and massage, has volunteered himself to work two days a week for more than 10 years at the Thai traditional medicine section of the hospital. He has been treating the patients with Thai therapeutic massage without taking any remuneration. Pirat, aged 74, revealed that he intends to do something for the benefit of society in the last stage of his life. Previously, he felt more and more dispirited, but seeing and talking to the patients makes him happier. These are the models of creating volunteer spirit in the hospital that has ignited the adoption and expansion of this approach extensively in the Thai health system. Not so far away from Prat Nang Kao Hospital, is Bang Bua Tong district of Nontaburi province, where rural environments surrounded by urban communities can be seen. Within a short time span after getting initiated at Pat Nang Klao, the volunteer spirit was also formed in the district, with a wide variety of experiences of the elderly volunteers. Their knowledge and capabilities have been applied to health promotion through a fun and substantive channel. A group of Granny's Puppet Show was formed by a member of retirees. Some of them are former teachers, former military officers, and others. Today, they get together to create happiness as puppet show performers. Members of the Volunteer Spirit Group at Bang Bua Tong Hospital said that they get together without coercion, dividing the work to be done according to their skills. The compensation they receive today is the feeling of happiness resulting really from giving. Not only entertainment activities does the Volunteer Spirit Group perform, they also disperse to help with the work in various units in the hospital. 
Moreover, they take part in creating a good understanding with warmth and compassion between the hospital and the patients. The Volunteer Spirit Group's membership is not limited only to elderly people, but young buds of Volunteer Spirit have also been grown. On weekends, the young volunteers will have a chance to learn from real-life experience outside classroom. Reading books, telling stories, and working at the reception desk are what the young volunteers are good at. But what is fun for them is entertaining the service recipients. While another group of young volunteers is trusted to work closely with medical personnel of the hospital, that is their chance to learn from actual practice. <laughs> this young student said that she is glad to come and help the patients. It is something she wanted to do a long time ago. What she receives in return is the smile of the patient and the good relationship between each other. Being a volunteer helps her to experiment and learn something that will be the foundation for her future study. <laughs> Dr. Prabhat Lila Prud, director of Bang Bua Tong Hospital, said that in taking care of people's health, only the Ministry of Public Health or hospitals cannot cover all the population as the number of medical and health personnel is limited. So the key to success is that partnership, networking, volunteerism and cooperation of different groups in the communities to work together and then the health services will be delivered more thoroughly across the designated area. Even though the volunteers do not receive any monetary compensation, what they actually receive are the happiness and pride resulting from exercising their physical, mental and spiritual power in sincerely helping the patients with loving kindness and good wishes. And through the power of voluntary spirit, Thai society will return to become the society of generosity, helpfulness and giving without expecting any remuneration.